In this video, I'm going to show you nine creative but simple ways to use the Lightbox Anything plugin on your Squarespace site. Now, if you stick around to the end of this video, I'm going to share with you a special code that you can use to save uh, on this particular plugin. Now, when I reached out to customers to get these examples or solicit these examples, um, they all said it's not creative, but you can share it anyway. So uh, let's jump in. The first one is a product example. So we've got an author with several books, and I think this is an excellent way to really display uh, each book in a very clean, look at these backgrounds, um, in a clean format. Uh, portfolios are also a very popular way to use this plugin. Here we can see uh, you know, a gallery, a um, little client case study. Portfolios, again, are uh, an obvious way um, to, to use this. Galleries, if you want to get a little bit more dynamic in how you present your gallery, uh, you can use the Lightbox Anything plugin. Um, for that as well. Now, floor plans. I tend to see a lot of floor plans. So here, for example, we've got a studio and they're using the light box to um, display the, the corresponding gallery. Um, here we've got some more floor plans um, and, you know, we can see a, a more uh, zoomed in version here. Product uh, specifications, um, comparisons, you can see here, uh, size charts is a, it's the one I always reference. Um, sometimes you might have uh, a, a, a gallery of logos and you, you want to add a little bit of context to those logos, you can do that. About pages, team pages, this is a very popular use as well. Um, several examples here for you. Um, and then let's say you want to use a, a summary block or uh, you can do that as well. So this is a really um, cool way to use the plugin. Um, now here we have a, uh, I'm not sure what to call it. But again, we can drill down into these different practice areas and, and get more more detail. So it's a way to organize your content without someone having to leave the page. Now, there's also the video light box, which is built into this plugin as well. So um, whenever you want to light box a video, whether it's a YouTube video, uh, YouTube shorts, Vimeo, uh, you can do that. In this last example, I'm going to share is a probably one of the uh, more innovative uses um, because it combines several different elements but together um, it creates a, a really dynamic um, sales experience where you can kind of progress through this um, build your own template and uh, these different stages open up in a light box uh, using this plugin. So uh, another innovative use case. And so you can check it out. Um, like I promised, uh, use the code plug 10. Let me plug it in for you right here so you can uh, see it in real time. Uh, plug 10. And uh, you can save a bit. Um, so yeah, hopefully you found this useful. Let me know in the comments if you have some examples of your own. I'm always curious to find out how people are using this plugin because there's so many different things that you can do. Um, it's all up to you and your own creativity. Peace.